Good evening, everybody. Hi. So that's New Creation by Jackie Francois. I just uh, felt like I needed to sing that one. There's so much going on, so many changes. It's a great Easter song. And now it's changes upon us. We had graduation on Saturday. We saw all the kids walking across the stage and, you know, 300 some. And, you know, there's a few tears every now and then. And, you know, um, nah, it, was, it was a beautiful moment. So grateful for all of that. And um, what's next? <coughs> so we're, we're, you know, kind of in gratefulness and praise mode and um, looking forward to, you know, the future for our daughter and um, yeah, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> More like for me <laughs> about letting go and all of that. So, yeah. So he knows what he's doing, right? Like he knows what he's doing. You know what you're uh, doing sometimes. Knows what he's doing. He knows what he's, knows what he's doing, yeah. Well, this is called High Above Our Way by Steve Angrizano and Curtis Steven. And it's a beautiful song. Um, I'm just, I know it's time for me to let go and, and let the wings take over. And so it's, uh, yeah. <coughs> There's a love that is greater than my own. There's a spirit that brings me back to life. There's a seed that's been planted in my soul that can only grow in the light of Christ. There's a mercy that's wider than my own. There's a hope every sinner can be saved. There's a power that rolls away the storm that is only found in the light of Christ.
is greater than my own. There's a spirit that brings me back to life. There's a seed that's been planted in my soul that can only grow. So he knows what he's doing. He knows that, you know, parents are put in this, you know, place. And we did our job, and now it's time to let go. You want to pray? Sure. God, we thank you. We thank you for our children. We thank you for your word and and uh, all the comfort that it gives us and the guidance and the teaching and the training that it gives us, Lord. And we ask you to, to be with Katya as she heads into this new chapter and, uh, and be with Mommy as she heads into this new chapter that she has no idea how she's going to survive, but she will. And, uh, but God, we thank you for, hmm, for all that you do for us and for all that you do for our children and we we ask you for for comfort and guidance and and just peace lord we ask you for peace we love you lord and we praise you amen amen <coughs> you know it was really cute was today was levi's graduation from kindergarten so we got to go see that so you know it's like one is aging out <laughs> from the school phase and now one's just phasing into now the rest of the school phase so it was like two graduations back to back and yeah it was, it was really sweet today you know kindergarten rocks and <laughs> that's right and and even last week come on who was it who willow went? so willow, willow had, her pre -K had her pre-k pre graduation graduation three graduations <laughs> in one week that's a big deal well and then all the you know the friends and kids who you know have their yeah, a lot of a lot of friends and family we've seen that, or parents and grandparents. But just a couple of verses I want to share. Um, uh, Proverbs is always always wonderful. Uh, Proverbs twenty one thirty. There is no wisdom, no insight, no plan that can succeed against the Lord. And I kind of circled that and wrote, "Do not worry." So I think that that to me should be confidence for all of us. Um, and that that's for you, Chantel. Uh -huh. And then. If we jump to Proverbs 22, 6, this is for you as well, honey. Look, it says she has your name on it. Train a child in the way we should go. He should go. Train a child in the way he should go. And when he is old or she is old, she will not turn from it. I should try that one more time. Train a child in the way he or she should go. And when he or she is old, he or she will not turn from it. And then there was one other area that I was just... I read it and it just gave me So comfort. the seeds that we planted, like we just said, new creation, or er, um, sorry, high above our way. He planted the seed. He's going to water it and, you know, he'll take over. So, or we water it, we plant it and water it and then he helps it grow. Yes. Okay. All right. So, um, and I don't know why I picked this, but maybe it'll speak to you. It spoke to me, right? Um, it's Philippians 4.10, and it's thanks for their gifts. I rejoice greatly in the Lord that at last you have renewed your concern for me. Indeed, you have been concerned, 
but you have had no opportunity to show it. I am not saying this because I am in need, for I have learned to be content whatever the circumstances. I know what it is to be in need, and I know what it is to have plenty. I have learned the secret of being content in any and every situation, whether well-fed or hungry, whether living in splendor or in want. I can do everything through him who gives me strength. Amen to that. Well, this next song is is right with that. We fall down. He'll give me the strength, and we just bow to him that he knows what he's doing. Take, Lord, receive. John Foley.
So it seems we've had a cat walking around. The storm loves the camera. <laughs> <coughs> we could see her. weren't sure if you could, but uh, but she does love to to visit. Yeah. Um. I don't know. I just I'm feeling distracted right now. I'm feeling. Um. I don't know. I'm like not coherent. Like completely incoherent and. I just, it's, I'm sorry. It's there's so much going on. We had like um, his niece here with her family for a week, and then overlap with Maxine who came in so she could be to the graduation. And I mean, it was so much fun in in so many ways, you know. And then there's like this whole juxtaposition of all that. So the take Lord receives. That was me just offering it all up and <laughs> trying to make sense of it. I don't know. Anyways, um, I'm gonna end it tonight. We're gonna end it tonight with I rejoiced. Um, Trevor Thompson, because you know what, this is a great moment for our kids. They're, you know, they're finally going to be rid of mommy and daddy, and they're going to love that, and hopefully, and they're, you know, maybe they'll miss us a little bit, and it's um, a good celebration time, and yeah, so here we go. So we should rejoice. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, let's just. Let's do it. We got to go with it, right? Right. <coughs> I can get. I didn't get good sleep last night. So, so the voice is rough here. Yeah, thank the Stark family for for their generous gifts and, um, of course, the little graduation happy faces. <laughs> yeah, there's lots of beautiful gifts. So, very blessed here. Yes. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right. <laughs>
for effort. That was really awesome, honey. <laughs> I'm